The numbers are staggering. A new book claims we are spending billions of dollars on criminals, but hardly anything on victims. Here are excerpts of my interview with Dr. Irvin Waller, the author of Rights for Victims of Crime, Rebalancing Justice. In the country that is so proud of its justice system, uh, there isn't really adequate opportunity for, for victims to get uh, simple sorts of justice. They're safety protected, reparation, uh, let alone what they would call justice. I knew from my earlier book just how much was being spent in the United States on policing, which is roughly a hundred billion a year, on courts roughly fifty billion a year, and on prisons about seventy uh, billion a year. And I knew from the 1984 Victims of Crime Act uh, that there was a bit less than a billion uh, going to increase the amount of compensation in the United States and to increase uh, services. You begin to see uh, that this lack of investment it actually means that victims are not getting the attention they should from the police, that the services aren't there. I'm suggesting two things in terms of the funding. I think uh, part of it is deciding that victims matter, that they're a priority, that they're important. The other area that would require some um, visible increase in funding is in compensation. And what I'm really arguing both on services and compensation is that the United States should bring itself up to uh, a universal standard across the whole of the United States.